This short video is an explanation of the technology behind the Imhotep project, a technique we call shadow projection. Before I explain this technique, I'd first like to identify all the elements that we'll be playing with. In this image of a stage, we have a lighting instrument, light, a character, and a shadow. The desired effect of shadow projection is to create this stage picture with one significant difference, an imaginary character in place of a real one. The end result is a disembodied shadow. In order to cast a shadow in absence of a body, the lighting instrument is replaced by a projector. This projector effectively paints a shadow onto the set with the help of custom footage. The custom footage is heavily edited video. And if you look at the unedited video, you'll notice that it's just a video of an actor. This video is recorded at an earlier date by a camcorder placed in the exact same location and orientation as the projector. Because this shadow is based on a real actor, our creative team can forget about technology and focus on building scenes with real actors, trusting that this technique will eventually transform one of the actors into a disembodied shadow. So, to sum it all up, a camcorder captures a video of an actor, this video is fed into a projector, then it is edited to make it look like a shadow under a theatrical light. Shadow projection provides the audience with a wealth of important information about the imaginary character. From the location and shape of the shadow, the audience will be able to figure out where the character is and what it is doing. When combined with movement, set interactions, real actors, and other conventional stage techniques, we plan to create an imaginary character that commands as much stage presence as a real one. For more information about this project, please visit our website at imhoteppproject.com.